So I'm Jonathan Hull. I lead our capital markets business for Europe, based in London, and spend my time around our major European countries, but also part of our global capital markets group for the US and Asia Pacific. Um, I think for Expo 2013, perhaps the major trends are around the uh, more general confidence that we're feeling in the markets at the moment. And perhaps 2013 Q4 is going to be the first time where all the markets are now more aligned, where we see generally everyone going in a more positive direction. So we expect investment flows to be um, at the same or, or greater levels than 2012. And I think as we look forward to 2014, I think we're going to see an increasing amount of global capital beginning to influence uh, the major cities around Europe. Uh, it's been the case for some time that um, London has been the, the magnet for capital around the world, um, both from the US and Asia Pacific. But one of the big trends at the moment is we're beginning to see that capital um, move on from London into the more um, broader capitals of Paris and uh, major German cities, and that's beginning to influence some of our major projects. So one of the big trends of the recent past has obviously been the focus of uh, the sovereign funds and major global institutions around core and core real estate in core markets. I think that um, we see that continuing, and I think very high-quality real estate with high-quality income streams will we'll sell very, very successfully. But we are, what we are beginning to see is a, uh, a preference for some of the institutions to go up the risk curve slightly and perhaps uh, focus on more value-added plays and begin to really uh, look at markets where we're going to see more leasing activity and, and more recovery, particularly those areas like Spain and Italy where we're seeing a more, you know, perhaps a more sustained recovery.